Now, Jimmy, it's uh, feeling a little nightclubby in here today. No nightclub ever felt this classy. Oh, well, you're classing up the joint, I have to say. Yeah, but we are here with two very, very classy fixtures, the Shapeshifter from High End Systems. Yeah, we've got the C1 and the W1, and see if you can guess what the difference is. Mm. This one's coloured, this <laughs> one's white. Yeah. Um, basically, this one's got uh, RGB colour mixing. This one's all white LED yep. modules. Uh, each of them has 126 Cree XP E2 LED chips, I mm -hmm. think that's right. Uh, and they're arranged in seven different modules on the face of the thing. In addition to that, we've got the Indigo highlighter thing, which high-end systems mm -hmm. have a thing about. And <laughs> just appears on everything. It's yeah. actually quite effective. It is good. Um, but look, what we've got uh, is seven segments which we can individually control the colours of. Mm. So we can uh, you know, have different intensity and different, different colours going on in each of the individual segments. In addition to that, we can pan and tilt each segment. Awesome. Independently of each other okay. segment. So we are talking beams. Yeah, and look, you can see on camera, this is this is a very tightly collimated beam mm. that we get out of both of these shapeshifter units. Yep. It's uh it's not a wash light by mm. any measure. Mm. This is this is a big effect, it's mm. a big beam effect and, and it's cool. Yeah. Um and it doesn't it doesn't look super bright at the moment. If I do that, Whoa. you'll probably see there's a bit more intensity there. Okay, so yeah. we're twenty four thousand lumens out of the coloured model? Yeah, 27 out of the W1. Okay, so it's big, it's bold, it's um, it's a bit crazy, it's a lot of fun. Yeah. Also kind of noisy as well, let's be honest. Yeah, and look, um, probably just before we get onto that, we should talk about the, the control options, which is that obviously all of this movement and colour control mm. and stuff takes up about a bazillion channels. There is a reduced format control mode for DMX, um, and that's good because it it basically just mimics the same movement and colour on each of the panels, uh, but you do still get macro functionality. In fact, you'll notice there's two different sets of colours happening on the C1, mm -hmm. and that's not something I'm sending it, I've just told it, do a macro. Right, okay, well that's a lot simpler. Yeah, now, mm -hmm. as far as the noise goes, yes. Uh, mm -hmm. This is probably not something you'll find in a theatre. No, but it's um, not the effect you're gonna want in a the theatre either. No, look, this is a huge, beamy effect light mm. and you know it's it's a big light it's designed for big shows mm. and really at the end of the day i think um it's a lot of fun it, it's masses of fun yeah 